A slow moving cleanup is underway in Levittown after a fast and furious storm wreaked havoc on Long Island homeowners. As I'm pulling the shade down, I swear, the stuff that was blowing in the street, unbelievable. Carol Nelson can't believe the intensity of what touched down in her neighborhood. It was like a, whoo, it was like not really strong, but it was, it had to be like a violent thing. She may have been spared of any major damage, but across the street on Clover Lane, neighbors say renovators working on this home escaped just moments before a massive tree toppled onto the roof. The guy was talking, the tree doesn't look right, we gotta get out. And the guy was upstairs, and the, the staircase in this house is in the front of the house. Oh so that's literally inches of his head coming down the stairs. And I see the tree like, I'm like, that looks weird. And all of a sudden comes through the house, I'm like, oh, what the Around the corner on Cornflower Road, these residents won't be returning to their home anytime soon. Instead, the family's arborist is busy removing the wreckage. We're going to take the branches off the roof and throw those through the chipper and then get this big log out of here. A confirmed tornado is to blame for the whipping winds of up to 60 miles per hour, rainfall, downed trees and power outages. Roots of area businesses ripped off. <laughs> Some PIX11 viewers took to social media to share their personal experiences. Then the winds calmed and before the sun set for the day, neighbors counted their blessings. Beneath a rainbow, their friends and family are accounted for. I think we all were lucky that somebody wasn't killed or hurt.